Hello to everyone. Welcome back to my channel. Today's question is the perimeter of rectangular plot is 180 meter. So we will write here perimeter is equals to 180 meter. It's a perim. Uh, it's a rectangular plot. So an area is 1 uh, 1800 meter square. Take the length of the plot as x. So we will write here length is equals to x meter. Use the perimeter 180 and write the value of breadth. So perimeter of rectangle is 2 into L plus B and perimeter is 180 is equals to L is X plus B. 2 is divided by 180 is equals to X plus B. Here 2 divisible by 180 is 90 minus X is equals to B. So, it is a breadth of rectangle in terms of x. Now, use the value of length, breadth and the area of the area to write an equation in x. Solve the equation to calculate the length and the breadth of plot. So, area is equals to length into breadth. Area is 1800 is equals to length is x. Multiplied with breadth is 90 minus x. Now simplify it. 1800 is equals to 90x x square minus 90x plus 100. Uh, sorry, it is it's a 1800 is equals to 0. Now simplify it. So LCM of 1800 is 2 nines of 18 2. Four the eight two five the ten zero two two the four two four two two the four two five the ten three seven the twenty one three five the fifteen three two the six three five the fifteen and then five five the twenty five and five one the five. Now here two to the four four to the eight eight three the twenty four five five the twenty five twenty five three the seventy five. Here we need two numbers having the sum or uh, subtraction is 9, minus 90. So here is 90, then 5 to the 10 and 5 to the 10. So 10 and 10 is here. 2, 3 is 6 and 3. So here is 6 and here is 3. 60 plus 10, 3 is 30. So we will write here x square minus 60x minus 30x plus 1800 because minus minus plus then minus 60 and minus 30 is minus 90 and when we multiply it then we will get minus minus plus sign. So in the first from the first two terms we have to take common x then x minus 60 and from the last two term we have to take minus 30 this is x minus 60 is equals to 0 so the factors is x minus 60 and x minus 30 is equals to 0 then x is equals to 60 and 30. So case 1 we will write here case 1 when x is equals to x means this is a length so we will write length is equals to 60. Then breadth is equals to 90 minus 60 is equals to 30. And second case, case 2, when length is equals to 30, then breadth is equals to 90 minus 30 is equals to 60. So these two cases are possible. So this is your answer. I hope it will clear to you. Thank you.